Indian superset, right? I'm gonna make different videos of these for different body parts that you guys wanna overtrain, right? Overtrain according to me and not the other overtraining. All right, so <laughs> this one is mainly for triceps, right? We're trying to focus on the long head. The reason yeah. why I try to focus on the long head yes. is not only because it's the biggest head of the tricep, right? But it's fucking sexy. It's the one that actually hangs down, right? This is the outer head, right? It's not that sexy. It's all right. It's all right. The long head is the one I'm still trying to work on, but it's this one right here, right? It's supposed to hang down. That's the one that gives your arm that mass on the side, right? The outer head, if it's really big, like Michael Clark Duncan, it shows from the side, which is still nice. But I want that Chris Redford from Resident Evil 5 tricep. This shit right here, right? So what you want to do is, the best way to activate that is any movement where your arm is behind your head, like this, or kickbacks. Kickbacks are amazing for that. Or behind the back dips or ball dips. And I want to show you guys this one. Simple superset, right? Just like the other video. You can do this every morning, every night. It's up to you guys. Uh, I used to do it every morning. Not this one, but the one for my chest. All right. Pick it up. Once again, you don't want to be too close for the sake of your elbows. You don't want to be too wide because you should look stupid as fuck. So just go like this. Now, don't bring it down to your nose or your eyes, right? That's going to be mostly your front that's in the outer head. For the long head, bring it back this way. You notice? You see that shift? Here, yeah, do it again. Armor? Sorry, do it again. Bring it back here, right? A little bit further back. So as I'm doing this, I already feel tension on my triceps. I didn't even start yet, right? Bring it down slowly and go up. Now, I do it mainly, well, I used to do it mainly just to pump blood into the muscle. I told you guys the story behind it. I had a dumb theory, right? I didn't, I didn't, it was really, like I said, 80% correct. But I just believe that if you put a lot of blood into the muscle, did a lot of pump work on top of your heavy workouts at the gym, it'll help the muscle grow. Eventually, I find that why it worked. But anyway, watch my other videos, man. I explain all that shit. So anyway, bring it back. And because I want a lot of blood action, I would just do pump reps, right? I would just do this, partial reps. I'm big on partial reps, so fuck you science guys out there that they oh, you gotta do full range of motion, full range of motion, fuck you. Full range of my nuts. Do it this way, right, until you get a big enough pump, right? Remember, you're just doing it to get a pump, right? I was just doing this at home. That was not my main workout, right? I had this dumb theory, and I wanted to test it out, and it ended up working. Just do it like this, right? When you're done, now you can bring it down here. It's gonna hit a little bit of your outer head, a little bit of your chest, just a very little bit if you do it right. Don't turn it into a close grip bench press. Wait, mama. Don't turn it into a close grip <laughs> bench press. That's going to be for, for the end, right? So you start off like this. You do like as many as you want. Come here. No, 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 no. Daddy's doing that. And then finally, <laughs> Natalia, what did I tell you about that? And then finally, you can turn it into a close grip bench press. Oh, man. And if you do a last, it's all triceps. I don't feel my chest at all. If you start off with close grip bench press, you're going to feel your chest and your front delts. But if you do it after doing this one and this one, it's all triceps. So this is like 30 to 40 reps, but I'm not really counting. Like I said, I just wanted to get a big ass pump. When you're done doing this, superset it. Superset it with kickbacks. Now I only have 10 pound dumbbells and that's all you really need. See? Right, you can do it one arm at a time or sure. both. Can you see the tricep? Sure. Sure? So it's not there. So I don't got a tricep. Right? Now, I learned this one from Johnny Jackson, guys. Before, I should just do it like this. But you can actually rotate that bitch. Look at that. Instead of doing this, you can rotate it. You feel. What? That looks nice. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You feel the tricep, the track, and squeeze that shit. Or, like I say, do your little pump reps. Right? You can do it with both arms. And that's, <laughs> it. that's, it. that's a good superset, guys. <laughs> She's not getting the camera out of my hand. Yeah, so do this one. This one, that's actually like a, a tricep version because you're doing it behind your head, down to your nose, close grip bench, superset with this, and that's one set. The whole thing has one set. And do it over and over again for five minutes max, right? That was my goal. It was At first it was three minutes, but then I had to bring it up to five minutes. I just love getting that big ass bump. <sighs> All right, guys, I'm done. I just shot like three videos behind this before this. So see? Rotate. 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 And don't forget, your bicep brings your arm up and also, what's that fucking word? Sup supinate? Twist? Yeah, anyway, your bicep does this and this. So your triceps does this and this, alright? That's why you can rotate that bitch. Alright, I'm out of here.
as soon as I get off the bed. So I'm not doing 15, 20 reps. I'm doing like eight to 10 reps, sometimes even six to eight reps, right? I just want my brain to be used to this shit, right? That was my bro science theory behind it back in 2011, if you watch my video. I had no idea why it worked. I 